Delivered by Wing. Bentley's coming, gets some sort of punch in it. Only falls as Fletcher. Fletcher can lob it back in. There's bodies all over the place. And eventually... He almost drops into Dave's hands. The ball, it? as Dave says, drops into Bentley's hands. And he's um, suggesting that he's hurt his shoulder. And I think what the... What, uh, so Inyaki, the goalkeeper coach, is over there and just sort of saying, what sort of movement is he going to have? Patrick Gunnison is getting stripped and ready. He looks like he looks like a man who might be about to come on for a, uh, for a debut here, which will be... Uh, Interesting. Patrick, um, first of all, congratulations making the debut. How, how did it feel when you came onto the field? It felt really nice. A little nervous, but when I when I came on the pitch and the game started, it felt just like a normal game. Final few minutes. How did you uh, deal with that? Yeah, I think I did a little right. Uh, obviously, all of the boys uh, helped me a lot. All of, uh, all of them came came to me and just do what you do normally, and uh, we'll help you. And, and they helped me a lot. So yeah. You know, his first touch in senior football. Play safe. Don't try and be the hero. So it's going to be a corner. And Gunnison. The one thing I'm told about Gunnison, he's got a very good mentality. Yeah. Um, so. Good win uh, against a strong team away um, and uh, the staff was talking about before the game that we could make history if we win here because we've not won, uh, won them before I think uh, and yeah just big crowd, big stadium and uh, really sweet to get three points. And it's finished, the full time whistle has gone and it's scarcely believable but Brentford have won by two goals to one, they were a goal down They've got a goalkeeper on making his English Football League debut in goal and they've won by two goals to one. The winner was scored by Saeed Ben Rama. The Brentford players are mobbing Patrick Gunnison and Brentford are all of a sudden six points off the playoff. They beat them in the first and are really close to each other and the gap between them is, is not, not that big. Uh, like like the co last couple of weeks, uh, they've, been in, uh, they've been having a couple of players injured. Then it's just up to the beating to step up and uh, Gets the change. Yes! <laughs> In terms of your final few minutes out there, when the ball came over the top, you pounded it right over the bar, weren't taking any chances? No, <laughs> not there. I think I was one of the first touches in the game, uh, so any, no, I didn't want to take any chances, I just tapped it over the bar. Um, and, I, and, I, and I love that it's part of our B team strategy, uh, developing young, young players, get them up to the to the first team, and when they need to step in, they, they step in and, uh, and they perform. And the same with Patrick uh, Gunnarsson, also you know, the last 15 minutes, 17, 20 minutes, something like that, just stepped in and confident, you know, with attitude. They both played with that, so so pleasing for for the two of them. Um, and I actually talked about to uh, to applause them after the game because they did well. Pleasing. So well done to. Uh, the whole staff, uh, everybody who works with the B team and to, to the whole club, you know, just prepare the players to, to be ready for us. It's, it's very pleasing.